wonderful site, and it's actually got a progressive web app that you can uh, download onto your home web homepage, and you can see every tournament that's going on in SoCal as well as uh, the power ranking. Yeah, and just it's all you know it, using the Smash GG API. Uh, uh, it's 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 crazy, man. I, I actually, shout, Michael, yeah, shout Michael. out to Michael. Shout yeah. out to Michael, the he, guy who he de developed. That. <laughs> you you I was, just talked about. I Michael, was really yeah, gonna gonna, gonna just say that yesterday yeah. at the Fat Arcadian. Michael was there, and he actually installed the app on my phone and showed me how it works, and I have to say it's great. So, um, yeah, going on to T-Mac versus Totes McGoats, starting off with the Wolf, strong pick. I feel like he's going to be able to counter a lot of a lot of the fruits here that Pac-Man will throw out, and the Bell, of course. Yeah, this is an interesting matchup. I feel like we've seen this on... Uh Across the seas a bit, right? In Japan. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we've seen this in many in many forms. Yeah, for sure. Okay, and you know, Pac-Man's oh. forwarder gets him Ooh. so much. Wow, the bell. He, he just barely missed his back there. That would have been a beautiful follow-up right there. Um, Pac-Man's forwarder, okay. it gets him a lot. I do remember. Toads by Goats has been playing Pac-Man since Smash 4, so he's definitely got a lot wow, of knowledge. Punishing. And it's showing, man. Tech in place. That's not the option you want to pick. F-Smash will cover that indefinitely. Uh, Wolf, double forwarder. Can, can T-Mac wrap this up before... Totes McGoat starts to get a lead on here. He could have reflected that hydrant. That would have been actually really for good sure. for him. Okay, and... Okay, so what's Team Mac got to do right now? I mean, he's trying to look for these forwarders. I feel like he could actually benefit from pressing a little bit more buttons, in fact. Uh, <laughs> kind of just letting... <laughs> Coming from the wolf main himself, yeah. well-spoken. Press more buttons. Yeah, man. absolutely, dude. <laughs> like, he, could, he could, like, spam forward air, like... Like, hey, get away from me. You use it like a sword. Right, right? no, absolutely. Yeah. I, I would actually, uh, I want to add on to that, that swords being disjointed. Wolf's aerials are very disjointed. His forward air, like you yeah. said, his back air being very disjointed. Back air is crazy. The, the, the front tip of neutral air being a great cover. Honestly, okay, we're seeing weak back air into up air. Toast McGoats, I mean, he's running away with the second stock. T-Mac is letting the hits fly a bit too much. Okay, I feel like he also could have gotten a stronger punish than dash yeah, grab. No, he's, de he's definitely not playing like super confident at this point chopsticks. but we can't count him out using the chopsticks the up smash taking that first stock only 98 percent back here he's starting to find his footing all right so he's recognized oh. that uh-oh okay wow. he's hustling him, he's that's what's happening hustling. that's what's happening oh my god he's, he's like oh you that. forgot i had a, had a blaster too I'm actually glad, <laughs> now seeing that, I'm glad he didn't use his reflector when I when I mentioned it on commentary because that actually netted him 50%. Like, wow. Let's go. Oh. Nearly bringing this back. I mean, okay. it's only 20% deficit. I like that option of using the melon, too, because it actually covered, like, uh, multiple options at that point. Right. And yeah. actually because it was a very tense situation and T-Mac caught. Oh, oh he, he should have just went for the straight down smash. The down smash would have just knocked him right off his feet. Oh, but he still sought it out. No. With, he sought Pac-Man out with the up air. Yeah, Look T Mac actually right doing now. doing really nice now. Okay, don't get too aggressive, man. Got to get yourself some extra credit. Pac Man got to bring this back. Both players really focus on doing what they have to do right now. Uh, and the apple a day keeps the doctor away. I like that. T Mac barely struggling. Maybe he needs to get a checkup. Uh, okay, one blaster and a fair. I like that. He's taking your advice, Edmund. Oh, that was a horrible roll. Getting eaten by the peach. Down air. Not gonna do it. Wonderful di. Oh, oh not a great smash. taking it away and not a great side B. Yeah. Oh my god. That was a horrible, horrible, horrible punish right there. Like nasty. Like that that I felt that from here. Oh, okay. Alright, but we're down to our final stocks here. It's very evenly matched game <laughs> again. Yet again, that's exactly this, what I want to see. I think I think this Players game in the series so has good. a weird way of yeah. working out to where people are the same skill level. Yep. I mean, you're just not gonna take that big of a lead. And right now, Totes McGoats getting a Oh my god, he almost punished that falling there with the F-Smash. It's, it's important that Toastman goes to seeing that far. Punishing whiffed aerials. I feel like if T-Max lands with another aerial, it might get F-Smashed. Okay. It's a very tense moment right now. T-Max trying to get some mix-ups, uh, movement mix-ups. Oh Throws my out god, what is he going for with a down air, man? <laughs> yeah, that, that, was, that was so Hail Mary right there. Okay, roll behind. Didn't get a punish. This is very tense. Both players... Oh my Ooh, god. The parry and a uh, smash. Taking it back, man. Team Mac did a really good job of adapting there. I mean, yeah. just after that first talk, it was looking pretty grim. I have to say, it was actually very fundamental play. Yeah. Punish, punishing, no, absolutely. Punishing a fair out of shield uh, with an out of shield. And, he, and like even that. then, I mean, what I had said earlier about him like being able to press more buttons, like I, I still think that's true. Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, how because many he of Wolf's <laughs> aerials have lag? Like, <laughs> like, 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 answer the question. Exactly. <laughs> 21, I'm going to ask you 21 questions about Wolf right All now. Right, okay? what's up? How good is his grab range? 
It's it's all right. His grab his grabs all right. You would say his grabs all yeah. right. Okay, because with aerials like those, you're gonna force your opponent <laughs> to shield a lot. And yeah, I, mean, I mean that's good. Yeah, you that, can you can. That'll open up yeah. many opportunities for tomahawks. And exactly. I mean, I, I hope to see. I I kind of a little expect that to happen this game, on on T Max side. Of the yeah, list. we can saw the confidence building, and now that he's actually taken a game, we can actually probably expect him to even be a little bit more aggressive potentially. So. Let's see how, how what happens though. Totes Magoat's really talented as well. As I mentioned earlier, has been playing uh, Pac-Man since Smash 4, so since the inception of the character. Yeah, he's he's OG main. I like that. I tried to do that one time, but honestly, I wanted to win more, so I <laughs> switched. Wow, that that narrow almost got punished again with an F smash twice now. T Max gonna have to kind of realize that and try to maybe land with a different option. Yeah. F All right. Oh. Yeah, the Hydrant's kind of throwing T Mac for a loop right there, and he's knocked out of his double jump. Yeah, he's just going to wolf flash in the I'm other really direction, straight into the blast zone. I'm so surprised he didn't tilt that, that Hydrant. That was, he, yeah. he let that happen. But uh, uh, Totes Magoats, very clutch kill there. Oh, oh I thought he was going like to go. The jab? Dude, yeah. The jab lock. Come on. Totes Magoats actually uh, showing us a little bit of a follow up game here. Yeah. Yeah, you know, actually, I'm very curious about what these downers do too, but T Mac is not punishing that, so. Uh, if it doesn't get punished, keep doing it. That's that's how this game should be played. <laughs> okay, he's T Max trying to find an opening. He's down a stock. Totes yeah. goats pulling out. I, I would say he's okay. probably gonna pull out a bell. Try yeah. to get a. I, I, I you can totally see like Totes goats mentality completely change in this game. He's like actually sitting back a lot more, uh, making it a, a lot more difficult for T Max, who's kind of just been resorting to blaster. Oh. Throughout. Oh, yeah. that was so sneaky yeah. to toss the bell through the stage. And T Mac said, I hate your sneakiness. I'm going to F smash you. Yeah, clean. So, two stocks apiece. The T Mac at 121 and off stage. He's going to have to up B straight to the ledge. Oh, that was so close. Totes Magoats has such beautiful like and interesting ideas and setups. They're just like, the, the spacing is off by like a, like a hair. And like, T Mac is just escaping with, the, with his life by a hair, literally. <laughs> Okay, and Totes Magoats is trying to get in, trying to play it safe, waiting for T-Mac to overextend just enough to where he comfortably yeah. feels like he can get a punish. Because, like, he whipped a fair there, but that wasn't safe enough to punish because right. his, his aerials are very safe. Yeah, exactly. It, it just doesn't seem like T-Mac's, like, spacing with the fair is, like, super on point. He's definitely getting a lot of, like, uh, damage with the blaster. And wow. He's not, like, the, the fair is such a strong, like, combo starter. So it's like... Isn't it? You, you got you to gotta be able to, like... Combo the fair to fair, fair to nair, like the bread and butters. Yep, absolutely. Okay, fair out of shield, fundamental. Wow, the roll away didn't keep the doctor away. Honestly, T Mac, that is rough. Roll in could have also yeah. been punished. Neutral get up probably would have been punished. It's hard to say. I'm not a Pac Man main, but I mean, the way that apple bounces, the hitbox looks very ambiguous. I mean, everything seemed covered there. That was rough. Oh, he's Totes Magoats getting so many reads right now. The beefy backer. And he just keeps spacing, like, as safe as possible. But it just doesn't seem like T-Mac really, like, knows what to do. He could be using a Reflector a lot more in right. this matchup. Yeah. Actually, it's – and it, it's – I don't know if you if you noticed, the the peach or the, the orange actually goes through Blaster. It, yeah. it went through twice, and that's actually crucial because if you nullify Wolf's Blaster, how much options does he have besides approaching you? And look at all these approaches that are getting whiffed. It's giving uh, Totes Magoats many, many opportunities to get whiff punishes. And, and, to and oh, he needs to deal with the Hydrant a little bit better, too. Like, he needs to be able to um, just, like, smash attack it sometimes. Because I, I haven't seen him really even attack the Hydrant too much. Right. Uh, okay, oh. wow, the Z-Drop covering side be back to the stage. Oh, there's oh. the Hydrant. Yeah, really quick option right there. He knew... He knew uh, Totes Magoats knew that Team Mac was like getting a little desperate right there. It was going to go right underneath him, get this kill, and he just could not. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, that was kind of a how to punish was, overextension yeah, 101. That I was mean, a rough, a rough game for Team Mac yeah. for sure. The last two stocks were were both overextensions actually. It's, but that, I mean, just that last that last up air getting punished with the hydrant it was it was crucial. I mean, but let's see what happens. I mean, I, I, again, he does play like Incineroar or, and. Uh, I, that's all I remember. <laughs> actually. If he stays wolf, what status do you think we might see? Okay, so we already saw um, PS2, and then what did we just play on? That was PS2, right? It was. Yeah, what did we play on the first game? Was it also PS2? It was a run back. Oh, okay. So, th did they just go back to PS2, you think? I feel like they probably did. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> hey, that's uh, okay, it. Went to Battlefield. Field. All right, all right. Hey, this is a pretty good stage. Star, star, star stage yeah. too. Star Stadium. <laughs> okay. The b b like tri plats are good for the spaces. I feel. Yeah. And to be honest, w having tilts that go through platforms, having an up smash that goes through platforms, yeah. is, uh, and Pac-Man having one himself actually. Well, I, I overspoke too soon. Both players having the same tools in that regard. Oh, okay. Ooh, where the was the dash? Is the roll yeah. in? Okay. Wow. Yeah. That, that was, was interesting. He could have dash tagged. Though. You're right. Went for the guaranteed. If we're talking about fundamentally, yes, yes. Um, it's tough to say though because he did get the roll punish. Yeah. No. So. No. He, I mean, he had the the read that I didn't. <laughs> oh. Oh. He let he lets Totes my goats land. That, so it's always good to pressure your opponent when they're trying to do something that's not guaranteed. Getting from ledge, landing on stage, those are the, 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 you know, your, your typical advantage stage is kind of, you want to be aggressive in general. You don't need to let them land for free. Okay, item play coming from Totes Magotes. Uh, T-Mac trying to evade that. I like that he's opting not to shield it, but actually run around. That's, uh, that's actually really good because now Totes Magotes won't be able to grab comfortably in. <laughs> he just did. <laughs> he literally just grabbed. Okay, all right. Even percents right here, 99 to 97. Both players yet to lose the stock. Uh, okay, see, like, he could just throw out Reflector right there instead of putting up his shield, which makes right. him so much more vulnerable. That was actually really unfortunate. He ran into the Hydrant. He actually yeah. was completely fine if he just stayed where he was. Oh, and the back yep. air, the beefy yeah. back air, too. He doesn't have a jump, though, so that t uh, uh, Orange is going to actually do enough knockback to knock him out. 107. That's very, very, very yeah. unfortunate. Okay. Uh, forwarder and Nair, just really good tools to force your opponent into shield. If they're jumping around and their attacks are missing, Pac-Man's going to oh. jump in with a forwarder. Okay. And T-Mac letting, letting Tosma go back to stage. Well, he trades with his fair. It's kind of a rough trade because he's behind now. and You really don't want to trade if you're behind. You, you want to make plays to get you caught up. Yeah, absolutely. And yeah, T-Mac's starting to throw out these up smashes. He should, he should be throwing out more kill moves. Like, at this point, I don't like, see a single space back air. Yeah, space <laughs> back air. <laughs> you know, maybe I should play Wolf. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But, yeah, space back air. I mean, it's such a beefy move. Oh, back, back throw is going to be enough good. to kill. That's actually the first back throw we've seen all, <laughs> all uh, set. Yeah. It's going to be a, at around that percent. That's a, that's a kill option. <laughs> it just came but time. I mean, he was at the ledge. It was a perfect option. Yeah. If he did any other throw, I would be a little ashamed. <laughs> but it's like something he could also be like going for more. Like, where are the forward tilts at the ledge to ledge trap? Absolutely. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Because he's going for down smash instead, and it's a little bit laggier, so it's not going to get you as much. Yeah, forward tilt is like incredibly fast, too, has like no end lag. Wow, that dash attack covering mm, two out of three options there. Okay. Will he let him back from the stage? Okay, very, very Ooh, good. Okay. Bell. All right. We're cooking. Got the grab. <laughs> All right. Where's oh, the crock yo. pot going? Oh, dude. Hit him with the downer. He wants it. <laughs> <laughs> Get the make your money, boy. Come on. All right. T Mac, trying to trying to find some life here. He's only he's only sixty percent away from bringing this back. Dude, a forward air with like to back air or down air. Oh yeah, it's easy easy money. Yep. <laughs> forward air to back air. Forward air to forward uh, air to snack air. Wolf's hungry, man. Nair 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 to freaking wolf flash off stage uh, or forward air to wolf <laughs> flash <laughs> off stage right now would kill too. So well, off stage wolf dude, flash. Yeah. Why would you want to do that? Oh though? yeah, just even up the stocks, dude. He's, uh, he, I he mean, wants to play like if he that's, DIs a, out. that's a bold statement. Right, dude, right. If he DIs like, out, yes, go. yes, I hear you. I hear you. But if he DIs and you give him a back air, just get just just yeah, keep yeah, it simple. Yeah, give him yeah. a back air because you want the lead right now. Yeah. This is this is for the marbles, man. <laughs> I don't want to right. style on you right now. But T-Mac has totally behind. brought this back at this point, despite the forty percent deficit, which oh. he's going to unfortunately Have to lose hold. that stock right there. Yeah. So he's at, at a, a much uh, bigger call oh right my now. Yo, what? <laughs> Come on, dude. Wow, what right, a call these, out. These players are reading each other on levels that I, I really quite don't understand. But, hey, it's yeah. working out. And we're down to our last stock in game and number three between Toast McGoats and T-Mac, yo. He's taking the lead to He got nares. demolished last game, too. Jesus, that's rough. He, he, he's really trying to make a statement saying last game didn't count. I'm, I'm here to stay, dude. I'm here, I'm here to win it. Oh, my God. No follow-up off the second fair. I'm a little disappointed. But um, Sparks fly in the heat of battle. The right option is never clear, and both players approaching yeah. last hit. It's getting tense. Dead even I'm clenching man. so hard right now. Both players could be killed oh right no, now. Double no, jump no, is no. gone. <laughs> Barely makes it back to the ledge with that wolf flash. You don't want a double jump like that. Oh, yeah. you got to hold on to your resources a little better. Yeah, air dodge would have been a better option. You, you can air ledge. dodge right there. You could always dip low and up B to the ledge. I mean, you have a safe hitbox. Uh, people Ooh. rarely contest that move, yeah. and very few characters can actually contest that move. 
Wow. Okay. Yeah, so special. I mean, I'm seeing a lot of I'm seeing both players try to contest each other at times where the other has the advantage, which is very interesting. Yeah. Like so I'm telling you, they have the reads that we don't, bro. <laughs> Team I'm I trying to up their oh, hydrants. That apple, another apple, a fresh apple. Oh, F smash! That was that was smash. Ooh, that was something throw. smash. Oh no, 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 no. He's trying to set up for down smash. Oh no! He wants to down smash, dude. It's like it's like. What's crack. happening? It's oh, crack. the water said you not. No, <laughs> no way! That, that I was thought, yeah. I thought plot that was oh my god! Who <laughs> won? <laughs> <Dude, laughs> <dude, laughs> no, he popped <laughs> off. This man is. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! I didn't even know who won. That was I like a neither. trade. Me neither, because uh, Toast Goats had thrown out the, the forward smash. I swore that Toast Goats forward smash.